Last year, I joined a woman's group in town, and right after New Year's, we had a vision boarding day hosted by Jennifer, who leads our woman's group every month. Jennifer has been a physician for more than two decades, and now she has shifted her focus to coaching well-being so that all aspects of your life are in alignment. I really appreciate that she is here, and I appreciate that she has this women's group and that she put together this day to focus on a vision board. Jennifer does have her own website where she shares her mentoring and coaching. I'll leave all the details below in the description. Make sure to check her out. I loved being in a room filled with laughter and conversation and, of course, a bunch of women being creative. Although I have to say I was really focused on what I wanted to do because, you know, this is my thing. This is what I enjoy doing. So I expressed my gratitude to all the women who were there, but I did pick up my stuff and spread it out on the floor because I really do appreciate having space to work. All right, so here we are, my 2024 vision board pages that I have made to fit into the Happy Planner. And the first page, of course, is all about YouTube. And the quote on the top is, We're liberated from our own fear. Our presence automatically liberates others. So I feel like by putting myself out there on YouTube, it'll liberate you. My liberation will help liberate you in some form or fashion so that you can live authentically. This is the banner that I have on my YouTube page, Adventures in Creativity, the word influencer, of course, let's go. Then I captured some photos. This is off of one of my YouTube videos, and this is a recent visit out to one of my favorite trails. I just want to go on more adventures, be around good energy, connect with people, learn new things, and grow. That was from The Cool House, a quote I found on Pinterest. And these images here are not my own, but they reflect my desires for this year. So this picture here is of urban sketching, and it looks like a cafe setting where you have your drink and the watercolors are out, and where... Right now, many of my videos are about how I handle time in waiting rooms and doctor's offices or hospitals. I would like more of my videos to kind of transfer over to hiking adventures or kayaking adventures and uh, share the art that comes from those kind of adventures. I really enjoy urban sketching, and I would kind of like to do more of that. And of course, in the corner here, is a stack of journals, completed journals. And again, they're not mine. It's a photo off of Pinterest, but I like the look of them. Okay. Next page would be a centerfold type layout here that has to do with my adventures and a healthy body to go on those adventures. And I really am looking forward to going kayaking this year. So you'll see a lot of kayaking references. Um, again, all from Pinterest. The photo of the woman jumping with the mountain and the lake. And I put the kayak paddles in her hand. Make memories. Kayaking, the great outdoors. The purpose of life is to live it. Eleanor Roosevelt. These stickers were influenced by Hickory State Park, sunshine, hiking boots. There's a tiny sticker from my Finch app that I use that says, I have what it takes to reach new heights. And the artwork on this hiking boot, I wish I knew who to give credit to, but uh, it's phenomenal. It has all the elements of hiking within the illustration of the boot. I want to do more instances where I just sit and journal. Like, I don't want to be on the run so much. I'm practicing mindfulness, which you'll see on another 
vision board page, but that idea of slowing down and journaling and not have to be go, go, go all the time. <laughs> Collect moments. And the healthy body vision board. I am continuing to work on my first pull-up. I can do negative pull-ups. Okay, pull-up. I can do one negative pull-up at the moment, and I'm getting stronger and more slow and controlled. That's very exciting for me. <laughs> I also want to get to a handstand. I love my fruits and vegetables. And there's another picture I found on Pinterest of these little children ballerina, but the one on the right is hanging upside down from the bar and it says, be the girl on the right. That is so me. <laughs> Inspired, empowered, every day is a fresh start. And learning to slow down and breathe. I've learned in man managing my anxiety, working with a therapist and a wellness coach, learning to slow down and take a breath. So this page was all about breathe, smile, be a light, just relax. These two are out of a magazine, that hammock, and of course she's got a book in her hand. I love that. And another image referencing just sitting with a journal outdoors, make peace with where you are. And the happy planner page right here. I just love that with the succulents and do what makes your soul shine. And this last page is all about mindfulness. And I was able to merge this picture out of a magazine of this woman kind of walking on the beach with this other photo of mindfulness written on the sand and the waves coming in. And I, I love the way the two of them kind of merged. And I do have some stickers on there, like this three-dimensional uh, bottle in the sand with the starfish and a little bucket here with the rake. But I have a picture of walking. I have a picture of the tea and reminding myself that it only takes three minutes like that is my starting goal just three minutes of mindfulness each time and reminding myself the world is a better place with you in it and up here this empty space i am exploring this mindfulness and i'm delighted to realize that i am mindful more than i realized so as i've been putting it into practice I'm noticing that, wait a minute, there are some things I do in a day that's mindfulness. So I'm celebrating that fact and I want to collect images, you know, like just taking the time to tie my shoelaces. That can be a very mindful thing. And I want to add stretching. You know, when I do my exercises, mindful stretching. Today, I did a real awesome rowing machine workout for 20 minutes. And there were portions of that that I was very mindful, very in the zone. So I want to save this space up here to kind of celebrate the different mindful acts that I'm doing. Yes, having gratitude, celebration. <laughs> So what are you celebrating in your life this year? There must be something, at least one thing, if you haven't done a vision board yet, but something, an idea you can hold in your mind. Share it with me. We'll celebrate it together. As always, guys, I appreciate you. Thanks for pressing play and watching, and I'll see you soon. Laugh at life. Laugh a lot. <laughs>